you see inside, oh, it's, it's all good cleaned out. He's here, uh, uh, that this intake manifold is uh, not heads. bad. Uh, a, a lot of, of the bolts parts. Probably the engine is going to have work. You'll see how uh, generator. You see how thick this is on this side, and, then, uh, and how absolutely thick this on this side. Let me show you. Not the engine. make that so obvious. Are you putting bevels? Here's the engine. He's going to have work. He's going to have work on the bolts. It looks like it's the same thickness. Mm -hmm. Let me the zoom in here and show you the cylinders. See how flat everything is around the valves and around the piston. Let me show you what he's going to have done on his other cylinders. Here, look the way they have it recessed and uh, cut, <laughs> cut deep and how smooth and uh, polished it is. That's going to give it a whole lot of compression and let it breathe better than here. Around the valves, they're going to cut all the extra meat and uh, make, it, make it a whole lot faster. Alright, I'm upstairs here in the loft of this place. This is even crazier. He's got an old, uh, it's like an old Triumph. Just sitting up here. He's got so much stuff just tucked away. Look at the frames. More frames. More frames. It's kind of dark up here, so I'll, I'll go slow and try to show you what I can. Open the ceiling. Fenders. Windshields. More bikes. I don't know, Yamaha. I don't know how that got here. An NSU. That's new to me. What we got over here, these look like little little scooter bikes. Little Hondas. all tucked in back there. Yeah, sorry about the light, but it's the handward belt. Oh, this one's for sale. 5900 That's not a bad price for that. There's one out of engine. Oh, all of them have engines. It's incredible. Incredible what they got here. Right down little mopeds. Oh, even collects lanterns. Like I say, I don't know how well this is going to look because of, of the lighting, but. Looks like somebody's Dale or Ryder there. Let's see what we got back here. Got a sidecar there. An old Triumph. Front into an old electric line. Huh, there's an old sidecar. I walk right by it. Almost looks like uh, Daddy Dirt Bikes. They call them a Dutch shoe. An old military bike. Very cool. Another one right behind it. It looks like he's got a radial engine out there on a the, on a stand. That's pretty crazy. Even got old antique uh, farm implements there, shovels and stuff. Pretty cool. All up there. Wow. Looks like he collects uh, shovels, antique shovels. Who would have thought? Unbelievable. Some motors back here. Old uh, antique outboard motors. There's an old loss out well, outboard, never seen one of them. This is a small antique engine. I can't I can't figure out what that is. Interesting. So I guess cabinets all headlights, all brass headlights from old uh, cars. The size of that one up there. Man, oh man, some of the stuff he has up here. Oh, what's this up here? Wow. I don't, I don't even know what that is. Simplex automatic. 
Pretty old though. Wow. It's a hell of a gear, heavy gear to be hanging up on a rafter. Pretty cool, man. All kinds of cool stuff up here. Like I say, sorry about the lighting. Looks like that cylinder head's back there against the window. Old motorcycle shop. Pretty cool. That looks interesting. I don't know what that is. Don't have a clue what that is. Looks interesting now. Almost looks like a sidecar, but I don't think so. Some kind of old horn. I feel like Mike and Frankie and Pickers. Pretty cool. Yeah, he's got all kinds of stuff here. I, I even walked past this. He got a little Maytag engine sitting down here in the corner. Maytag 92. Pretty cool. All kinds of pumps and engines. Chainsaws. You name it, he's got it. Or belly number. 43. This is the number size of 43. Mm -hmm. 43 as well. Match set of cases. But that's, this is yeah, military stuff. And then after the war, the, the, uh, that's G. But the California, a lot of the stuff was in California. Check it out. There's a, a well bucket from the 1800s. Pretty cool. And here's a shovel, turn of the century shovel. Pretty interesting, man. Talk about a collection. He just told us all about these shovels, and uh, really, really interesting. All right, I gotta go. Here's something you're not gonna see anywhere else. It's a only water-cooled factory Harley Davidson engine, only one in existence. They scrapped this project. This is the only one left. Water cool. Check out the rocks on both sides of the road here. They cut they cut away to in between just to, just to put a road in. Pretty cool. some of these trees yet. You know, well, I'll show you when we get down lower into uh, off the mountaintops and you'll see that down lower, you know, the trees are already bloomed and full bloom and everything, but uh, up here, I guess, I guess, uh, I wonder if it, it gets down to freezing still up there, Bill. I don't think so. Yeah. So they're, they're about a month or two behind us as far as uh, foliage goes. Look at that. May 6th, everything's dead. Incredible. Just thought you'd find that interesting. Alright, tubes. We're going down a steep incline here. And uh, we're starting to get a little foliage on the trees. But uh, I want you to look at that mountain way out there. You've got to get on the other side of it. But we got a surprise for you. Where do we get up to it? We'll show you how we're going to get on the other side. Beautiful view. 
Vista. Yeah, we're descending fast. If you look around, all these trees here are green, all full of leaves. It's incredible how uh, just a few miles it changes. this bitch. It's a Lehigh Mountain. We're going to go right through the middle of it. The Lehigh Tunnel here. Try to keep the camera steady. Yeah, I'm sure a lot of you guys never even seen a tunnel or know what they are. And they got fans going under here for the exhaust. There's more fans. How good the light is going to be. Look at that. So far, there's four sets of fans, five sets. I got them about every uh, 200 feet. That's crazy. How long do you think this tunnel is built? A little over a mile. Wow. A mile from the middle of the tunnel. End of the tunnel. That was a lot faster than going over it. Alrighty. Hope you enjoyed that.